So Marathon Digital had a great day, rightfully so, as it's a proxy for Bitcoin. Bitcoin hit 50K for the first time in several years. You have to go back to 2021 in order to see prices trading at those levels. And again, digital rose roughly $3 in today's trading. And if you scroll down to the 15 minute chart, it was really out the gate right away. This is the 9.30 a.m. Eastern 15 minute candle. And it just kept rising throughout the day. Now before we continue with the analysis, look at where prices are heading next. Let's look at this article. So Marathon Digital shares were trending higher again for an obvious reason. Spot Bitcoin prices are bouncing back after several weeks of price declines thanks to the selling at GPTC. Not only that, the bull case for Bitcoin may be getting stronger as well for those seeking exposure to rising Bitcoin prices. Marathon Digital is not only a worthwhile choice, it may offer a greater level of potential upside as crypto mining stocks can often make moves outsized compared to that of the underlying cryptocurrency itself. So it has a very high beta relative to the Bitcoin prices. And, uh, you know, I've heard that the beta can be 6x crypto price itself. Marathon has been aggressively expanding its Bitcoin mining capacity. This has in turn resulted in a stronger increase in production levels. For instance, during the month of January, Marathon produced 1,084 units of BTC. This represents a 58% increase compared to the prior year's month alongside increased production. It's something else that is a major positive for Marathon stock forecast. Well, number one, there is a huge short squeeze on the stock, so that's going to benefit the bulls. Among those more bearish on this and other crypto mining stocks, there has been concern about the impact of upcoming halving event on profitability. However, well aware of this challenge, Marathon has been proactive in its efforts to improve its core structure. They can accomplish this by achieving economies of scale through acquisition. A good example is with a recent announced acquisition which Marathon says could reduce its mining cost by 30%. The Marathon stock forecast is clearly promising irreverse, irrespective of the further Bitcoin bull market. However, if a bull market continues, it could serve as more than just the proverbial cherry on the top. It all has to do with the high operating leverage inherent with crypto mining operations. Analyst consensus may call for 58% earnings growth for Marathon, but the high end of forecast calls for earnings growth of nearly three-fold. All right. So we know Bitcoin's going higher because Wall Street wants in. Wall Street will be forming in now and soon. And this is just the U.S. ETFs that launched three weeks ago. Every major country will have their own Bitcoin spot ETFs, and you know what that's going to do for the price, and you know what that's going to do for Marathon. All right, so kind of going to the weekly chart, we did have a sell-off back in December when price hit roughly $32 and sold all the way back down to a level of support. However, prices find itself within a couple of dollars of that recent sell-off once we close above the $32 level. My next target is $48. But that's not all. Let's go to the monthly chart. We get through $48. My next target is this $100 level. Now I will put a zone here. That is a monthly seller's level. You have a drop in price, a basin candle, and then the drop. This was a level on level as you saw price kind of came into that level. It 
let's look at that and see what we're talking about on the weekly chart all right so that's not a real level for me this rejection wick tells me that the orders are above in this weekly sellers level all right so I'm going to take that off the chart let me know what you think how high is marathon going to get in this bull cycle thanks for watching subscribe please like the video